Hello there. Uh, this is Sir Proud. Uh, stick around, the thumbnail is not clickbait. Uh, today, we'll be going over some world blocks news. Some very interesting things that have been posted. Alright, so Maximus said, Everyone, are you an elf? Which of the new biomes would you like to see first? And, especially if you go over to the Twitter page, or as X is now told, we, if we zoom in, we can see all of these new, it's like, that's like nine new biomes. That's like, that's crazy, mate. It says, which of these new, what do you think these new biomes would like? So, yeah, if you want to, so yeah, definitely put in the comments what you think the biomes will be like. This is, but, but then later, uh, we saw in the Discord server, the vote, we saw, by an overwhelming majority, number four one, which in case you don't know, that, that's, uh, that's this like chilly looking, uh, biome. So, so that one, that one, that one won. And if we scroll down, uh, I'm not gonna waste too much time on This is basically, this is basically if you're on the phone, it fixes a bug where you still have premium. They also made it so now you get free, so they also made it so if you're on mobile and you watch an ad, you get free temporary features instead of just one, I think. But yeah, so if you're like on the phone, that's like a, it's like new, and you haven't paid for it, which you should, by the way. Worldbox is a good game. You should definitely buy premium if you're on the phone. And now, that's just saying that the update is out. And it's another message saying, nothing much to see here, just some new biomes from, from outer space. However, if we click on this link, we can see, if we, if we go in here, there are some interesting things here. So, oh. so if we uh, zoom, no, I run that zoom in. We can see right here. If, if I'm editing this, uh, hopefully I remember to zoom in on it. On, on all of these, there are like some new little, little more little tabs, some more things to do with kingdoms, which you know it's always a good thing. It's like. We're not, I'm not really sure what these are. Maybe like diplomacy, diplomatic stuff. I think one of these is religion. And also one of these is currently being shown. It's like this little heart thing. Is that like some sort of romance thing? But anyway, definitely look forward to that. We go back to the Discord server. Says everyone, onion, 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 onion. For some reason, Discord votes got broken and they couldn't make a screenshot. Which is very unfortunate. Uh, if you look at the... If we uh, look at the Twitter version of that, there's not much else to see there. Oh well, have an... For some reason, Discord votes got broken and I didn't make a screenshot. Oh well, have an onion. And as you can see, there is an onion and it's a very sad onion. I think we can all agree that that onion has significant levels of sadness. So we go, we go back to Discord server, and he's he's <coughs> he enters a bunch of images, which eventually all merge to form this. It's like a monolith thing of more lemon and goat creatures. And um, and that has a link to a to a Steam page talking about the update. It's it's not a big thing; it's mostly just images that we've seen before. It says hey there, just want to let you know that progress on the update is coming along nicely. We are super excited about it, and it's going to bring, bring some significant changes to the game. We don't have a release date yet. Since we're still working on coding brand new mechanics, but stay tuned, we'll be posting out more sneak peeks on Twitter and Discord as they're ready. You can also expect a more detailed runtime on the Steam community down the line. 
So that's that's exciting news. And if we scroll down, it says nothing but bur tree ease. And that lead that if we we click on the link for that, if I can just find it. it says it's Monday, Birches, which is very <laughs> it's a strange joke that they're pulling. But if we so as if you, as you can see in the screenshot, there are a bunch of trees. I think they might yeah, I think they're just normal trees. It obviously looks like birch trees, which this must be one of the biomes that they're adding. So by the way, if if I'm too my OBS is telling me I'm a bit loud, so if, so if like uh, you're watching this and I'm a bit louder than I should be, definitely tell me in the comments because I, I can fix it if, it if there's a problem with it. But otherwise, uh, it, it, it can say. All right, and if we go back to the Discord server, um, we scroll down. It says two posts in one lucky day, and that leads to a Twitter post saying. A very lucky biome. Hashtag worldbots. And you can see this is like a there's like some humans here, it's like a king with his family. And there are also more importantly some four leaf clover trees. Which I didn't even know that existed. Wow. Worldbot is teaching me so much. You know, before I thought candy biomes weren't real, but then they appeared in Worldbot and you know, now I know that they're real. Now I know that four leaf clover the biomes are real. So yeah, obviously this must be, must be some sort of lucky biome, I'm guessing. But yeah, hopefully... But yeah, expect, we should expect good things when I'm getting from this. We scroll down. This, now this, this is what we've been waiting for. This is what you clicked on the video for. It says, no vote. And that leads to a burpo saying, guess which three new sentient species are going to be added to the next update in the world bots. Guys, this is huge. Three new sentient species. In, in case you don't know what that means, currently we have four sentient species, and they are the humans, orcs, elves, and dwarves. And he's saying he's going to add three more. I'm I'm not sure what they're going to be. I, I'm thinking maybe the species from the diversity mod from from Worldbox, which adds, I think, goblins. Uh. Let me just try to think. Yeah, that's all I remember about it. So, sorry, I haven't played modded world bots in a while. Now, anyway, if we go back to the Discord server, it says, not real holiday, sorry. And it leads to a Discord but no, a Twitter post saying, Happy Canada, Canada Biome Day. So he's doing a lot of like biome leaks. And obviously, this seems like some sort of Canadian biome next to the birch biome that we saw from earlier. But this is definitely very interesting. Oh wait, oh, wait, 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 hold on. What's that up there? I see something up there. Oh, I can't zoom in on it. But it's definitely something up there. It's something suspicious up there. Some little bit of grey. Unless my eyes just my eyes deceive me, but you know. I have to go back to the Discord. I think we're almost done. Matt and then posted a bunch of pictures. And then he took basically post I'm not gonna look at this, but it's a bug report where mobile players would lose their like the the would have premium disabled or something, but it should be fixed now, so I wouldn't worry too much about it. And so then to so there everyone, family heart. And that and it's in the link to a Twitter post about the Sour Bitter War. Which seems to be a war between the Onion Biome and the... Uh... Lemon bi Biome. And... You notice the World Bots logo is a bit different in the bottom right corner... Well, left corner. So... In so these are some interesting developments. And yeah, there's some very good artwork, I will say. We go back to the Discord server. 
We scroll down. We get we get everyone uh, Rocky's emoji. And that leads st a straight to another Twitter post where we actually see some of the icons for new biomes, which are the the summon biome and what looks to be a Giga Shad biome. Like I'm not sure it's just me, but that stone that looks like a Giga Shad. Like, like I'm not the I'm maybe I'm just the only one who thinks that, but <laughs> look at I mean, wow. It's definitely a Giga Shad if you, if you are to me. All right, back to Discord server, and then there's a, a bit more of some artwork. But that's that's quite exciting. So in total, that's like we have we have got like three new sentient species that are going to be added, a bunch of biomes, and I can't find it. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff. Okay, three new sentient species, a bunch of biomes, and some more like kingdom mechanics. This is definitely going to be a fairly large update. And all right. Uh, also, one thing. Before I go, uh, sorry I haven't been uploading recently. I've got a lot of, a lot of tape, um, a college work I need to do. However, and I will make that a uh, World Box documentary in a second, just the episode one, like episode one drawn of Civilization as you voted for in the polls. However, uh, yeah, right now I've got a lot of like school stuff that I need to do. But I figured I'd make this just so that you're not left completely hanging, and I also wanted to cover it because of the sentient species and stuff. But yeah, uh, other than that, thank you for watching, and goodbye. Hopefully my audio doesn't suck.